Taiwan's Air Force scrambled on Sunday to intercept jets from mainland China that flew around the island. Beijing said the flight was a necessary action under current security situation across the Taiwan Strait. Taipei's defense ministry described the People's Liberation Army's patrol as a threat to regional peace and stability. Beijing has been flying what it calls island encirclement drills on and off since 2016 when Taiwanese President Tsai Ing-wen first took office. Beijing maintains that the self-governed island, which broke away in 1949 after the Civil War, remains part of China, and that Tsai, who was re-elected last month, wishes to push the island's formal independence. She says Taiwan is an independent country called the Republic of China, its official name. In a statement, the island's defense ministry said the mainland's J-11 fighters and H-6 bombers flew into the Bashi Channel to the south of Taiwan, then out into the Pacific before heading back to base via the Miyako Strait, located between Japan's islands of Miyako and Okinawa, to the northeast of Taiwan. During this period, the national military appropriately used air reconnaissance aircraft and air defense forces in accordance with combat readiness regulations, it said. The ministry provided a picture of a Taiwan Air Force F-16 shadowing one of the Chinese H-6 bombers. The Chinese Communists' long-range far-out-at-sea missions have impacted regional security and stability and endanger the peace and welfare shared by all parties in the region, the ministry said. Senior Colonel Zhang Chunhui, a spokesman for PLA Eastern Theater Command, said the patrol also involved an unspecified number of destroyers and early warning and control aircraft. The patrol includes targeted real combat exercises, it is completely legitimate and legal, Zhang said. In view of the current security situation across the Taiwan Strait and the need for safeguarding the sovereignty, this is a necessary action to be taken. Relations between Taipei and Beijing have further declined with a trip to the United States by Tsai's deputy-elect William Lai Ching Tae. Lai met officials in the U.S., prompting Beijing to protest to Washington.